Hey, hey, Brian Sensei here. In this video, I want to talk about Office 365, which is now Microsoft 365. This is the online workspace that you can use to store files, share files, collaborate, and do a host of other amazing things. Also in this video, I'm going to show you how to log in and we'll look at some of the different plans that are available to you if you choose to upgrade your plan. Let's take a look. All right, so with Microsoft 365, you can do some amazing things. You can store all your files in the cloud online and you can access them from anywhere on any device. You can also download the Microsoft 365 mobile app so you can access these things from your phone as well. Now, within Office 365 or Microsoft 365, I should say, you have the entire Office suite. So you have Word, Excel, PowerPoint, Outlook for your mail, Microsoft Teams for collaborating and communicating, OneDrive to store all your files in the cloud, and you even have more great apps, which I'll be digging into uh, in future videos. But this is essentially the Office Suite in the cloud. Now there's various plans you can choose from if you want to upgrade to some other plans, which I'll look at here in just a minute. As I said, with Microsoft 365, you can connect from anywhere. It doesn't matter where you are, what device you're on, you can access your files and other data. And you can share your files with others so you can collaborate with them in real time. That's right. You can be working on a document with a friend, a family member, a colleague in real time, or you can work asynchronously, right? When you, whenever it works for you to go in and update the document. All right, so uh, really quickly, just wanted to show uh, there's some different plans available. Now, if you already have a Microsoft account, you have access to the basic plan which gives you five gigs of storage space for your cloud files. And you have access to a limited number of the Microsoft 365 apps. You do have the option, however, of upgrading your account. For example, you could upgrade to a personal or family account. And here are the options. You could buy the family plan here on the left, or you could buy the personal plan. The personal plan is $69.99 a year. It comes with Word, Excel, PowerPoint, Defender, OneDrive, Outlook, OneNote, and the ClipChamp Video Editor. And you get up to one terabyte of cloud storage. The family plan gives you a plan for multiple people from two to six, and this costs $100 a year. You get all the apps uh, that the personal account provides, plus you get the family safety app. And each person, gets one terabyte of storage. So that's a look at the potential plan that you could upgrade to as an individual or a family. If you are a student, you might be able to get a free subscription to Office 365 Education. You can come to this page, which I will put in the description of this video. You can come in here and enter your school email address to see if you're eligible for the free plan. This gets you Word, Excel, PowerPoint, OneNote, and Microsoft Teams, plus additional classroom tools. All right, so how do we log into Office 365 or Microsoft 365? Well, the simple way to get there is by going to office.com. Once you're here, you're gonna to wanna to click Sign In, either down here or up at the top right-hand corner where we see the profile picture and you'll just go ahead and sign in with your Microsoft account. And when you land here, you're going to see your home dashboard where you can begin creating a new file or you can scroll down and see your recently opened files that you can begin working on. And then at the top left, you have your waffle where you can click and begin browsing all of the apps that you have access to. Well, all right, that does it for this one. In some future videos, I'm gonna be going over how to use some of the individual apps within Microsoft 365. I hope you liked this video. 
If there's something else you want to learn about, let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, I'll see you on the next one.